Welcome everybody to Carol's Art Room. I'm going to do a bloom on this large, this is a record underneath here. I uh, just scraped something there. So I'm going to do a rainbow bloom. I got all rainbow colors. And uh, that's what I'm attempting. Okay. <clears throat> All right, I'm going to pour this down and hope this is enough. Just add a little more. This is some runoff paint and some Glidden Essentials that I just mixed together. Gave me a little bit thicker paint that I wanted. Stir this quite a bit, so there's probably a lot of air bubbles. Break a few that way. <laughs> Lightly do it with my torch, just lightly. All right, okay, I'm going to start with I'm going to use this orange. I tried, it was a little bit opaque. So I want to make sure I'm going to put some orange on the bottom. I'm just going to reverse the last two colors because this has got some opaque in it. This is Carmen Red by Arteza. That's a nice red. The orange was um, Cat Orange by Pebio and Bright Orange by Decor. The yellow is some Azo Yellow by Amsterdam. And some Cad Medium by Windsor & Newton. There's a couple of different yellows together. doesn't matter which one you use.
some green, yellow green, a little bit of yellow green by Amsterdam and some Windsor Newton permanent green medium. Made a nice green. I got some blue deco art sapphire and some cerulean blue mixed together. Cerulean blue, I think, is an artist loft. Real pretty blue. I got some purple, blue violet flash by uh, Color Shift and some amethyst decor. some Payne's Gray. And I think use my big blower again. I'll try it anyway. I always give my cell activator a good stir. So this is Payne's Gray by Amsterdam and Australian Floetrol. a quick torch. Sometimes I like blooms. When you use the hair dryer, it blends the colors really nicely. And I like that. Now, of course, I stirred all these paints just recently. I'm going to get a, a lot of air bubbles. Even though I gave it a quick torch, I didn't want to torch it too much. And I always lose my 
my skewer. Now I'll give it a big spin. I don't know whether I should modify this one. I'll just do a little bit of swirls around the outside. There, that's pretty nice. Okay, the middle is back. All right, I'm gonna give this a, stir a spin now. Let's see if I can get this to move. I think I'd be here all day with, with all these bubbles. something in here. Jeez, look at all those air bubbles. Holy moly. That's 
what happens when you stir your white paint before you do a bloom. Not fun. Note to self. Okay, <clears throat> how much more do I need to spin this? just came off. Well, it's very pretty. even with the white dots. I can't keep up with all these. <laughs> anyway, I'll do it later. I think I'll just give it another little spin. Okay, I think I'm done. Oh, those rainbow colors are so pretty. Thanks for watching. I'll put the dried result at the end of the video. All my recipes are in the in the description under the video. And I'll see you in the next one. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe if you haven't already. The middle school really pretty. Have a good day, everyone. Bye-bye. Hi, everyone. Here's my uh, bloom on the record. It's drying really nice. Nothing moved. Vibrant, very vibrant. I like the way this one turned out. Thanks for watching and uh, have a good day. Yep, these are the rainbow colors. Bye bye.